happy day. Oh, wonderful day. It is an awesome opportunity and a blessedness that we are here together as we're about to hear from our devotional, God's Big Idea. I'm Andy K, and today is November 13th, and our title is We Are In His Hands. And our scripture text is coming to us from Ephesians 1 and 23, which reads, The church is Christ's body. The church is filled with Christ, and Christ fills everything in every way. When Jesus was on earth, he taught people about God. He healed the sick and fed the hungry. He helped people who were in trouble. But now Jesus is in heaven. He has asked us to help him. He is counting on us to tell people the good news about how they have been saved from sin. He depends on us to help when someone is hungry or in trouble. Since Jesus is not here, we are his body. When we help others, we are his hands. When we tell others about God, we are his voice. It was Paul who came up with this idea that the church is the body of Jesus. Paul wrote that Jesus is is the head of the church and the church is the body. The head must have one body through which it can work. Let's say a scientist finds a cure for disease. Is that enough? Will people start getting well now? No. People have to be told about the cure before it can start helping. Doctors must learn about the cure before they can start using it to help people get well. The cure is there. But the scientists need help to let the world know about it. Jesus has the cure for sin, but people have to be told about it. People need to hear what he did for them. They need to experience his love, his forgiveness, and his grace. This news must be spread. That is the job of the church. That is our job. God's plan for our world is in our hands. It depends on us. Our title was, We Are In His Hands. Thank you again for spending these beautiful moments with me. As I read from our devotional, God's Big Idea, come back tomorrow where we get to do this all over again.